Hello everybody and welcome to our VSL and VS Code installation guide. First we want to install VSL, therefore we are opening a Windows PowerShell with administrator rights and there we are typing VSL minus minus install. Now um, normally it would take one or two minutes time until VSL is installed. In my case, it's already installed. So yeah, luckily. After the installation is successful, we open either VSL or Ubuntu or something like that. So um, I will open Ubuntu real quick. Um, you can just type it in into your um, search bar. And now we are trying to install Anaconda. Um, to install Anaconda, we go onto this link and search for the latest Linux Anaconda version. It's this one here. We copy it. And now, as you can see in the instruction, um, first we have to download the latest version. We do this by typing um, this vwget into the terminal. I will copy it real quick. And the version we copied has to come after this. So here you have to insert your version. So in my case, um, this would be it. So we download it now. And after the stuff is successfully downloaded, we are typing bash with once again the version we took to install Anaconda. So now we want to install Anaconda. Um, we have to press enter to continue. Um, scroll down until we can accept the license agreement. Well, this takes a little while. <laughs> so now we have to answer yes or no. If we agree the license agreement, we type yes. And now Anaconda will be installed to the proposed uh, location. With enter, we can confirm the location. So we um, Press enter, and as you can see, in my case, um, the file or directory already exists as I already have installed Anaconda. After the installation, we close our VSL or Ubuntu terminal and reopen it to reload the .bash configs. After reopening uh, Ubuntu, we test whether it worked with which Python. And um, as you can see, this is the path where Anaconda is installed. If it doesn't print the path that has Anaconda in it, we have to manually add the path to the bottom of our dot um, bash rc file. Um, we can simply do this by um, opening an explorer. Uh, most important is to type backslash backslash vsl dollar and now we have access to our Linux distribution and um, 
we have to add it to the bottom of the file. I guess it's in home, your name, and then here it is. We open it with the editor. And now you can see um, everything from the uh, from this file, and we have to add this line here to, yeah, simply um, tell where the path from Anaconda is. Cool, great. After adding this line to our bash or C file. We can simply test once again the uh, which Python, and if now the right path gets shown, we have successfully installed Conda, and then we install VS Code. To install VS Code, we go into this link and install it. Um, I have already installed it, so I simply open it. And after installing it, um, we can also install VSL over the extensions. Yeah, it's already installed. And if we want to um, uh, make a connection to our VSL distribution, we simply click on to this uh, button in the uh, left corner and uh, click on do a enable in the connection and then we enable the connection to ESL. So uh, hopefully everything worked for you and um, have fun using uh, VS Code with VSL.